Well, again, it depends what sort of drugs you're talking about. Um, like, you know, harder drugs like Class A drugs are used everywhere in and out of sport. And obviously, certain drugs just don't have their benefits when you're doing sport. Obviously, some drugs will decrease your performance and make you ride or skate worse. Yeah, like for instance, if you inject some heroin up your ass, you'll probably find that you're not really skating very well. But if you might find that if you like sort of have a bit of a split for that, you might sort of relax a bit and just sort of enjoy what you're doing a bit more and sort of relax into it a bit and I don't know, sort of it kind of helps you to set your own pace maybe a little bit, something like that. Stuff like steroids and performance in you know muscle building drugs and that. I've never, I've never seen anyone using that. I've never heard of anyone using that. I guess you get that sort of thing more in bodybuilding, obviously, for its obvious advantages. But you know, I guess it's more of a personal thing. Like when you're BMX on skating, it's for your own personal gain, yeah. So because it's your such a personal thing, if you're to take something that's essentially cheating, the only person you're cheating is yourself. So that is why I wouldn't, you know, even consider doing any drugs like that. Or, or plus the fact that you have to put needles in yourself. Go like that needles. <laughs> and, um, but yeah, I, you know, I can't see the point of um, cheating yourself like that, really. And you know, when it comes down to it, and they, you're the only person who knows how you reached where you are. And if you know you cheated yourself, there's just something a bit empty about that, really. Cool. And how would you feel if, say, it came out that Lance Armstrong or someone like that had mm. been taking performance-enhancing drugs? Well, yeah, I'm not a keen road biker, but I can see that people that are close related to the sport and stuff like that probably would okay. just feel quite resentful yep. towards that person I guess just because they they aspire towards someone like that and then to find that they're actually lying essentially which is obviously quite disrespectful to all your fans and you know generally rude to anyone that supports you as such I would probably you know if I was a follower of someone like Lance Armstrong and I found that they were doing drugs like that I'd probably stop being a fan of them really I guess because they're they're not a good role model they're nothing worth aspiring to yeah so I guess that's not a good idea. But you, you hear about all the time the Tour de France and stuff like that, and it's, it gets ridiculous to the point where they're drugged up so much they need drugs to undrug themselves to sleep. To, you know, it's ridiculous. It really is ridiculous. Wicked. You want to have?